Bosnia entered its third straight day of violent clashes on Friday. Protesters have been venting their anger over privatization plans and unemployment. It's the worst civil unrest in Bosnia since its war in the 1990s. The protests began in Tuzla, the industrial heart of Bosnia. That's where mostly laid-off workers were angry over the closure and privatization of state-owned firms. But then the protests spread to towns and cities across this impoverished former Yugoslav Republic, where more than one in four worker is without a job. It was our government which sold the state companies for peanuts, leaving people without their pensions and social security. Their families have nothing to eat while our politicians sit in the institutions and steal from the people. In the capital Sarajevo on Friday, thousands set fire to the central government building where they were met with rubber bullets. The unrest is unprecedented in post-war Bosnia. This is where Serbs, Croats and Muslim Bosniaks have tolerated political stagnation for years rather than risk a return to ethnic conflict. Dozens were reported injured in the clashes, mostly police officers. The government has called for an emergency session and called on protesters to negotiate.